People change their names for all sorts of reasons. Marriage, divorce, and outright disdain for their parents' choice rank among the top reasons. But must courts honor all requests to change names? In Neil v. Neil, the court refuses to restore a divorcing wife to her maiden name. At the same time, the court unexpectedly grants the husband's request to change their child's name. Did the court exceed its authority? On September 10, 1994, Melissa Gintz married Bruce Neal. Melissa took Bruce's surname, becoming Melissa Neal. Their marriage wasn't happy for long. Melissa and Bruce separated in 1995, while Melissa was expecting the couple's child. Melissa petitioned for divorce, requesting orders to govern custody of their soon-to-be-born child and restoration of her maiden name. Melissa gave birth to the couple's son in July of 1995. On the birth certificate, Melissa gave the baby the surname Gintz after her maiden name and didn't list Bruce as the baby's father. The court held a hearing on the divorce petition. While testifying, Melissa learned for the first time that Bruce wanted to change their son's surname from Gintz to Neil. The trial court granted a divorce, ordered Bruce to be added to the child's birth certificate, and ordered the child's surname to be changed to Neil. The trial court refused to restore Melissa's maiden name without explanation. Melissa appealed to the Missouri Supreme Court.